So today we're going to Universal Studios. Yes, we are. And look, there's like hardly anybody here. And we're going to try to fit in some uh, Islands of Adventure also. So, join us today and I may be able to film a little bit of the ride. I don't know, but I'm going to try. Here's some mini golf. They have a Monsters. I think they have an Alien course too. This is on City Walk before you actually enter into the park. On the little moving walkway. Please watch your step. There we go. The sign's back up. All right. Making our way up here. Universal Globe. There's Chris right there. We have a Transformers ride in here. Pretty fun. We gotta get some Simpsons on video because I heard they're probably gonna get rid of that in a few years. Okay. Please let me take pictures that Okay. Just walked in. They're still doing construction here at the old Shrek ride. I think this is gonna be a Minions ride. Because right here. Despicable Me. I don't A whole bunch of stuff. So we're gonna go ride something and take you along with us. All right, I lied. We're gonna stop to eat first. Let's see what they got at Louis Italian. I'm sure it's. Basic stuff, but we'll see. Here you go, baby. I got the spaghetti and meatballs. Me we always too. get them pretty good. Yeah, looks, looks pretty got good. the chicken alfredo there. Chicken alfredo, the oh, coke. And that meatball. And that the meatball so salad. Look at that. I'll try that. Oh, we'll have salad. to enjoy our comida. Yeah, it's not bad. The four of us and the souvenir drink was like 80 bucks. So yeah. they get you on that souvenir drink when you need it. Yeah, but it's worth it, you know? Like, for us especially, because we constantly are we drinking We have children. Yeah. Anyway, I'm going to eat. Mm. Well, here's what's left for the Jaws ride. Before they made Harry Potter, that was Jaws. I'm going to see this shark eat this little girl's head. Over here by the Simpsons. There's Lombard's Landing. It's a good restaurant. And the Mardi Gras head over there. There's my people. All right, so getting close to Harry Potter World. You see the outside. There's the Double decker bus back there, maybe you can see it. I have no idea where we're going to start at today, but we may go in there. I don't know. Let's see. King's Cross. That's where you take the train to go across to the other park. We have a park to park pass. So it looks like we are going to start in Harry Potter World. Looking around this wall here. If we ever get there. You see everything. It's not too bad. As far as crowds go today. It's pretty crowded, but. Oh, that's crowded. Let's come down. The restaurant in there. I don't think I've eaten that, that one. But that's where the dragon... No, oh, the Green, Green Gots Bank ride is over here. Okay. This up there. Oh, these people. 
you go walking around with wands. Press pass for it. So anytime you come, try to get an express pass. Very helpful. way in guys so we don't have to wait Proceed too long to the right? large office at the end of the corridor where because we're trying to cover two parks today in a few hours okay there we're going some statues back there we go now before we move How did you get in here? We have to see you. Well, well, let me keep you from your tour. I just need to pick up. Roller coaster ride with sudden and dramatic acceleration. Climbing, stopping, and dying. Even some in the magical community find. the third or fourth room. This one's going to take us downstairs, allegedly. The door's open and there's the ride. In there somewhere. does a lot when I ride. Spins you around, takes you up, down, everywhere. Gotta get my usual wife's opinion. It's always a thumbs up on this one. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna, how many times you rode it? I think we prefer Universal Parks to Disney's, but, you know. Yeah. For your opinion. We just support Universal Studio people, I guess. Yeah. Ice cream parlor. They have seasonal selections too. Oh, I think the dragon's gone. says fur friendly flea powder. They have that here, I guess. Oh, the fair fortune. Oh, where are we going here? Oh, the butterbeer, okay. Of course, we got a good butterbeer. So I opted for the pumpkin juice. They got butter beers. One of them reminded me I didn't like the pumpkin juice. Yeah, it tastes like fruit juice though. It's kind of like, I mean, you can kind of taste a little pumpkin seed, but it's mostly like a fruit juice. 
kind of thing you can do in the Wizarding World. People buy wands and they're interactive to the environment here. So they got to do little tricks to get the wand to go. But if they do it right, like this umbrella will uh, spill water. So there's a line of people waiting to do this. Not me though. And so far, no one's got it to go. What happened? Alright, so we turned around, we're coming back the other direction. You see the dragon there. I don't know if you can see the buildings, but they got like little stars painted on them. The Wizarding World of Harry Potter. There's an the ice cream shop right next to me. Ollivander's wands. So if you don't buy a wand somewhere, they'll go in there and they'll uh, they'll pick one out. Or they'll pick one out for you. Yeah, there's a candy shop at the end. The guy with a top hat. People in robes. Some people come every day in robes. Ready? His wife says we're done with Harry Potter, so we'll catch up to her. Okay, there's that double-decker bus. You can actually go talk to the little guy that drives the bus. Look, there he goes. No more. No more. That's it. All day long he does that. Good to see you. They don't I heard you can go in the back of the bus and get on. Let's go look, baby. So this is the inside of the double decker bus. It's got beds. You can see there's toothbrushes. And this is, I think, his uncle sent the bus to get him. It's like the emergency bus where they pick him up. All righty. They have the little steps to go upstairs. I don't think we can go upstairs. But anyway, it's right here by the fountain. Beautiful building here that my wife pointed out. I never really paid attention to it. So now we're walking wow, towards Crustyville. Let's take a look out here at the park. Oh man, this is pretty out here. Transformers over there. I hope you can see it, guys. It's kind of bright. I can't quite see everything on the screen. So Crestyville, Simpsons Land. I want to get a film because this may not be here. Probably it's going to be here for a while longer, but eventually they're going to, from what I've been reading, it might go away because Disney bought like everything like they do. So they may change this into something else. It used to be Back to the Future. There's the Men in Black with the little UFO things up there. Men in Black's a little shooting ride you ride in. It's pretty good. I think we're gonna go ride the Simpsons. We got little games back there, whack a rat little basketball. This is really the only part of the park that has games with prizes other than like in Halloween Horror Nights Halloween Horror Nights will have some games and prizes out there nothing major but it's just fun it's just to me this park is a lot more fun than the Disney parks 
Everything's close together. It's lively. So we do like Animal Kingdom. We will like Epcot. Like there's a quickie bar over there, like in the show. There's a lot of cool stuff here. Nah, I'm cool. I'm just enjoying the park today. Where's the Duff guys. Rose tap. Let's go see where Homer hangs out, huh? All right, Rose tap. Never been in here. Oh boy. There's his big friend. His empty beer glass. There's the love tester. You want to do the love tester? <laughs> Table. Yeah. 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 Look at that duff yeah. beer. Yeah. Regular mm. Three eyed fish. <laughs> There's a pay phone. Nothing there. Uh oh. Look at my wife. You made a hot tamale. Made a hot tamale. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the <that> loot form. Even if it's cold fish. <laughs> That's like everybody's looking. Yeah, I don't oh, think that one. We'll see. Uh, Coldfish. Yeah, nah, this like. Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. I'm the only home. You're not a cold. The other place there said I was go. brain dead twice. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> hey. Oh, we were somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> My machines said I was brain dead. So I have a cold fish. <laughs> Guess those games aren't meant for me. Those and crane games. <laughs> Hard lead donuts. Okay. Now here's a cool landmark you may or may not recognize. Sure you do. Lord land. It's huge. There's Bumblebee Man's tacos. Simpsons land is pretty big. It's a good sized land. <laughs> there's a train from Hogwarts. Oh look, there's a DeLorean. If you want to go back to the future, it's the only part that's left before the Simpsons ride. Yeah, I don't. Brain dead twice and cold fish. Man, I tell you, I'm on a roll. Scan card. Oh, it's the universal photo. Oh, photo thing. Stuff I won't order, but you can. I got the drink. All right. Oh, there's Shrek over there. Kind of see him. Okay. It's the last bit you'll see at Kitty Land. Woody Woodpecker. Surprisingly, they kept SpongeBob. Squidward and Spongebob, let me get a picture of these guys. 
from the outside. <laughs> that way I don't have to stand in line all day. So here we go. Going to ET. I'm lucky. Now, ET is an original opening day ride here at the park. It's also one of my favorite rides. I think my favorite ride at all Universal is Velocicoaster. But the Harry Potter one was fun. Hagrid's a really good ride. So let me get up there. <laughs> Alright. So here we are. It's a 15 minute wait, so I don't even think we need to use our fast pass here. Alright, the ET ride, they show you a movie with Steven Spielberg, a young Steven Spielberg, it's kind of weird. And then you go in, you give them your name, they give you this card, and you scan the card before you get on the ride. Or before you get on the ride. And at the end, ET hopefully will say your name. And there's a cool little cue line, I'll try to show you some of it here. I'm Steven Spielberg, and it's my pleasure to welcome you to the E.T. Adventure. But I'm afraid we don't. Okay, here's some stuff in the line. The astronauts checking out things. <laughs> Forest. I don't think we're using our express pass here. Oh, you're gonna have to press those get to the right hand side. I mean, the passport you. There he goes. It's usually a big light show with this guy, but. Well, smoking lights. So, this is one of my favorite cue lines. It's a speaking spell. We're gonna walk right by that. He wants to go home. <laughs> a little waterfall. I don't recall the waterfall ever. I know it's been here. Alright. Now I gotta ride, so I don't know if I can film this thing. But I want to see this later on too. favorite ride at all the universe just because of the nostalgia factor yeah. except Velocicoaster is awesome what you think man? remind you of the old days oh yeah oh yeah but you know I was sitting there and I was like looking and I was like man one day like I know they're gonna change this yeah I know you I know? got some of the ride on the video so yeah, I know. just a little bit it. yeah uh, 450, uh, 450. Yeah. What was that again, man? It's a VHS, but it's actually a pair of socks in there. <laughs> I was wondering why it felt like that, but look. That's so Isn't that cool? E.T., cool? e. Jaws, and Back to the Future, huh? Socks. Kids don't even know how to put that in, you know? You kind of put yeah, it in that. I don't even know what that's for. Yeah. I used to watch Toy Story. Try to put it in yeah. the toaster. Or sometimes you have to rewind it. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah, and if you they forgot to rewind it, they would charge you. Yes, they would. <laughs> People that had little rewind machines. 
take a picture with this guy if you want. I think there's another one that used to be. There he goes on a bike. But that's why he's in the closet and oh, that's wrong. Oh. Here's a really cool shirt. I don't think my wife likes me in these shirts though. All the more reason to buy one, huh? Okay, we're gonna walk to Transformers. There's Mel's drive in. It's a makeup show. It's pretty cool. It's the same show all the time, so. If you've seen it once, you've seen it a few times. But it's still entertaining. Alrighty. I was gonna get in line, but Megatron walked out, so let's go show you Megatron. You wanna go talk to him? Megatron over the other robot. Bubble Megatron is just crazy. Good talk, mess to you. So at the time we're coming, they're doing Mardi Gras stuff. So my daughter just found one of their stands that she's interested in. What do they got? Oh yeah. Shrimp boil. Well, my daughter really loves the crawfish and shrimp boil that she makes at the house. So. That's a yacht one? Uh, well, maybe later, but I want to... Well, because we're going to ride Transformers and go over next door, but... Oh, you all yeah, got one now to start with Mom? Yeah. Which one do you want? The uh, crawfish and yeah. shrimp or the crawfish bowl? Crawfish. crawfish and shrimp. Yeah. All right. All right. So I got my wife. A Category 5 punch. Which is the Myers Dark Rum, the Cruzon, Aged Dark Rum, Passion Fruit Puree, Grenadine, Orange and Lime Juice. So let's go find out what Mole Lady thinks about it. So, what do you think about this drink here? Well, I got the virgin flavor. She got the loaded flavor. <laughs> <laughs> it's really good, actually. It's really good. It's yeah. got orange, lime juice, it's got rum, and all kinds I got of good stuff. A lot of good stuff. Mm -hmm. That's what I got. It's right. really good, actually. So it's a good drink? Mm-hmm. Fruity? Oh, very fruity. fruity. I like, like, fruity, sweet. But not too sweet. Yeah, yeah, not too. But this is, like, really, really good. Perfect. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right. Okay. Blues Brothers, rolling through town here. Shrimp doesn't really have flavor. All right. Sweet. I recommend getting one of these drinks. I think they're, like, 20 bucks for the first one. And then the more you get, the less you pay. But you're going to need it all day. Free refills around the park. They have uh, special machines for them. And then I bring a backpack, which I recommend. We bring our batteries and cameras and stuff. Throw them in there between rides, which is why I can't film during most rides. There's the crawfish balloon, crawfish shrimp balloon, what's left of it. Apparently, it's been approved of. And here's my wife, she's happy. All right, we're gonna take the train across to Islands of Adventure. To do this, you need the park hopper pass, the park to park pass. So, uh, gonna get in line and get on the train. It's an actual train. There's a track for it, I've seen it. I've been under it. And there's the train. There's an actual train that we would ride Universal. Islands of Adventure. There's the big owl. I think that's Harry's owl. Steam engine. Right. 
two trains. Somehow they split in the middle, and what comes back here? Oh, it is not a forever one. Hi, guys. show a little movie on that window and there's gonna have people running outside our door but we're sharing our train so I don't want to interrupt everybody Mm-hmm. 